morning, all participants, and welcome to the international training course on development of agricultural resilience capacity through water management with climate smart irrigation system. First, I would like to introduce myself. I am Kebra Sitishok, a faculty member of irrigation engineering department, uh, faculty of engineering at Kapaksa Campus Kaseta University. And I am um, Dr. Chupan Champujan, also uh, the faculty member of uh, irrigation department, uh, faculty of irrigation, uh, faculty of engineering at Kampang San. At the beginning, before we are going to start uh, the training, I would like to start the this training course with the opening ceremony by the welcome statement from Thailand International Cooperation Agency, we call it Taiga, by Ms. Hatay Chunok Siri Wathan Kun from Human Resources Development Cooperation Division and the video of Taika's mission. Good morning from Thailand. On behalf of Thailand International Cooperation Agency at Taika, I am very pleased to warmly welcome all of you to the opening session of the online annual international training course on development of agricultural resilience capacity through water management with climate smart irrigation system. This training course is jointly organized by Taika in collaboration with the Department of Irrigation Engineering, Faculty of Engineering at Kasesa University, Kampang San Campus. Let me take this opportunity to give you a brief introduction about Taika. Taika is a department of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Thailand. We are designated by the Royal Thai government to be the main focal point for coordinating and implementing international development cooperation. Taika is committed to providing forums where Thailand's experiences and good practices can be shared with other countries. The online annual international training course is one of our flagship programs. Our courses are categorized under five themes, namely public health, sufficiency economy philosophy or SDP, food security, climate change, and other sustainable development goals related topics. This online annual international training course on development of agricultural resilience capacity through water management with climate smart irrigation system is under the climate change theme. The course will equip participants with knowledge and skills necessary for water management in the agricultural system in the context of climate smart irrigation. In addition, you will learn the importance of reducing greenhouse gas emissions from the irrigation system so as to improve and maintain climate resilience and get familiar with the concept and implication of smart farming and IoT for modern irrigation systems. If you have participants from many countries, your active participation and contributions will add international perspectives to our in-class discussions. This will make each of our sessions even more interesting and valuable. Moreover, I do hope that the connection that will be established among all of you and the Department of Education Engineering, Faculty of Engineering at Kampang San Campus Kasesat University will continue to serve as an active platform for exchanging useful information, views, new ideas, and experiences beyond the two-week training course. To facilitate that, I would like to introduce to you our Facebook page, Taika Fellowship and Alumni. On this page, we share updates and information which our alumni may find useful, such as online courses, Taika activities, and tentative training program. Therefore, please visit, like, and share this page. I would like to end by expressing my sincere thanks once again to the Department of Education Engineering, Faculty of Engineering, Kasesa University, Kapang San Campus, for their work in conducting this interesting training course. I wish you a very fruitful and successful training. Thank you and Sawadee Ka.
global and regional challenges have inspired Thailand to become a trusted partner and a true friend in international development cooperation. We aspire to share our experiences, lessons learned, and accumulated knowledge during our development past to other countries near and far as a provider of sustainable and effective official development assistance or ODA. In the 1990s, Thailand reached a milestone in our development cooperation by becoming a provider of ODA. To reflect this new role, Thailand International Cooperation Agency Taika, was set up under the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Thailand with the responsibility of overseeing Thailand's official development assistance and implementing development cooperation per the aspirations set by the government, the Thai people, and the global community. At Taika, we have been playing an active role in providing international development cooperation, particularly in Thailand's strong sectors such as education, public health, agricultural and rural development based on His Majesty King Pumipon's sufficiency economy. Currently, Taika has implemented various development cooperation projects and provided a number of postgraduate scholarships, training courses and study visit fellowships to Thailand's neighboring countries as well as other developing countries in Asia, the Pacific, the Middle East, Africa and Latin America. Thailand's international development cooperation places the demands of our development partners at the core. Each country's needs are matched with compatible experience and expertise. We provide bilateral development cooperation and work with other providers of development cooperation under triangular and regional frameworks to ensure that projects and activities are practical and realistic in order to make a lasting, sustainable, and global impact. Taika has been dispatching Thai volunteers overseas to foster people-to-people -people connections with our development partner countries. The Friends from Thailand volunteer program also expands opportunities for the Thai public to take part in Thailand's growing development cooperation. In addition to bilateral and triangular development cooperation projects, Taiga organizes annual capacity building programs through provision of short-term training fellowships under the Annual International Training Courses AITC, postgraduate scholarships under the Thai International Postgraduate Program TIPP, and the discussion forum on various approaches to development under the Burger Roundtable International. At Taika, we hope to see a future of narrowed sub-regional and regional development gaps, a more competent workforce, fairer distribution of income, lower barriers in trade and investment, and enhancement of transport connectivity. At home, Taika is the lead agency to liaise and administer Thailand's official development assistance. It is transforming itself into a learning organization ready to deal with the changing environment, both domestically and internationally, in order to fulfill our commitment in international development cooperation. Thailand International Cooperation Agency, building bridges for global sustainable development. Thank you, Taika, for the welcome statement and the video of Taika's mission. And next, uh, I would like to invite Associate Professor Dr. Chai Si Suksarod, the faculty member of Aviation Engineering Department and the head of this training, will briefly report about the objectives and detail of the training course. 
Uh, Professor Chai Si is on, on Zoom right now. Okay. So Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Shuhan and Dr. Kevela. Good morning. Sawadee Distinguished Christian of Faculty of Engineering at Kampeng San, Kaseksa University, the chair. All participants, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the training organization team, the Department of Education Engineering, Faculty of Engineering at Kampeng San, Kaseksa University, I'm so grateful to report the training course summary to the chair. The international training course titled the development of agricultural resilience capacity to water management with climate smart education system has been developed in order to introduce the principal concept of allegation development and water management in the context of climate change, the concept of greenhouse gas emission reduction from allegation scheme in order to improve and maintain resilience to climate change, the principal concept and application of smart farming and IoT for the modern allegation system encompassing the Thailand experiences. This training course is operated as an online mode. It was prepared with the most effective learning course supported by the Faculty of Engineering at Kampeng San and Kasesa University and Thailand International Cooperation Agency or Taika, the funding agency. The lecture with invited expert speaker and the intensive program of its class in water management and education engineering field will be delivered to the participant along two weeks from now. In first week, they will expand their new perspective on module one, allegation sector challenge to the interface of climate change. In the second week, they will gain modern technology for allegation and water management on module two. There are 34 participants from many countries who are allowing in this course. We expect that all of them will enjoy our session and hope that they will be able to apply the knowledge and experience gained during the training course to their further project development in their country. After the course, it is expected also we will become an international academic and professional network for working together in other future missions. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much, Dr. Chai Si. And finally, I would like to, in, to invite Associate Professor Dr. Chow in Prasit, Dean of Faculty of Engineering at Kampang San Campus, Kazazad University give a speech to open the training course. Please, Dr. Chow. Yeah, um, on Abdu to the international Firstly, I would like to thank the Thailand International Cooperation Ministry. Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Department of Education Engineering, Faculty of Engineering at the State, at Command Center, the State University, for organizing training course in order to enhance knowledge, experience, and develop the capacity of training in water management for the agriculture system under the context of high change. University has a strong ambition to guide the society towards sustainability. This intensive training course will guide and educate you regarding a variety of these pertaining to share key current knowledge and high experience in water resource management in the early case of the culture sector under climate challenge. I think you I sincerely hope that the lecture virtual will visit and discussion in the section and the information share can be applied effectively in your work. Your work, that your hard work will continue to make food and lead to further climate resilience of allocated 
a g r i c u l t u r a l sector with smart technology in your country. Finally, I wish you accomplish this training course. Thank you. สวัสดีครับ